Hey guys, it's Anna and welcome back to my channel. So today I have a super exciting video for you guys. I'm going to be sharing my baby shower haul and I'm so excited to share it with you guys because I know I have a lot of expecting mamas here on YouTube, especially on Instagram, who really wanted to see this video because you guys are working on your registry and need all the inspo. Trust me, I was the exact same way. I was like watching back to back baby shower haul videos on YouTube, going through Pinterest, asking people on Instagram, Instagram friends like what are the essentials so I totally get you so this is why I am doing this baby shower haul for you guys before we go ahead and get started I do want to mention to you guys that our baby shower vlog is up since I am going to be putting that video up before this so if you guys have not checked that out I will link it up here in the cards for you guys as well as down below and in that video we do reveal baby girl's name so in case you guys want to go ahead and check that out first before this haul I will give you some time right now otherwise I'm going to be sharing her name right now it feels so good to say her name here on YouTube as well as Instagram because we've been having the name ever since we found out we were pregnant basically and we are naming our sweet baby girl Mia Anna Hernandez and we just cannot wait for her to get here her name was like everywhere in that baby shower because we are just obsessed with her name is just like she's our Mia and we cannot wait for her to get here and really quickly before I get started with the video I just want to say a huge thank you to my parents my family and friends who all came out to our baby shower and showered us and baby Mia we are so incredibly grateful for you guys so without any further ado let's just go ahead and get into the haul video so I'm going to start off with like baby items first and then move on to the clothing. So the first thing that I got was one of the highest recommended items that I got from you guys when I asked you guys what I needed to register for my registry. And it is a boppy and this is the one that I got and I love it. You guys are going to see throughout this video there's going to be a theme. And Mia's room is going to have touches of yamas in it. So that's why I registered for this one that has a little yama. And it's pink. And I like this one. I think this one is deluxe because it's two-sided. So this one is super soft and has a fleece on this side. And then this side is more of that synthetic material. So you have both options. Sorry, I'm going to be out of breath. 33 weeks here. It's getting a little hard to breathe. So I just heard a lot of good things about this one and I heard that it's really essential to have especially to pack with you for your hospital bag because I do plan on breastfeeding. Hopefully I can breastfeed and this just made breastfeeding so much easier. Another item that was highly recommended was the Noza Frida. So I, go ahead, I went ahead and registered for that but my friend was like since you're registering for that why don't you go ahead and register for the bundle that the Frida Baby offers. So that is what I did and that's what I got. And this is the Frida Baby, the Bitty Bundles of Joy. So you get almost, I think, everything that they have in their line except for like the extra stuff that comes with each of these items, like filters and stuff. So what's inside is the Noza Frida, which is the snot sucker. Then you get the Windy, which is the gas passer, the Nail Frida, which is a snipper clipper, and then the Frida, the mom washer. So this kit is such a good gift to give because you can try out everything at the Frida Baby line that you want, especially since I wanted the Frida Baby nose Frida. So like I said, all you have to do is just buy like the extra stuff that goes in it, but you have the main thing. And what I love about this is that you can get it in a bunch of different retailers. So whether you register at Babyless like I did, or if you register just at Amazon or Target, they carry this as well there. Next thing we got is a bottle warmer. And the one that I chose was this one. This was by Kindy, I believe, and it's called the Cozy. I got this because my friends recommended it and it had the highest reviews that I saw. So I was like, why not? Let's go ahead and try it out. The next thing we got is a baby carrier. And this is the Lily Baby Complete All Seasons Breathable 3D Mesh Baby Carrier. And it looks like this. It's by Lily, like I said, covering the main thing because they put her address on it because it was shipped to our house. But I am planning to baby wear Mia. And I got this carrier mainly for my husband, Michael, because I saw in my mom groups that the baby carrier with the most like husband approve was this little bad boy right here. And I know he's not opposed to like wearing 
Mia how I'm going to be wearing her. I'm planning to wear her with the Solly wrap and a Wild Bird sling. So a ring sling. He was like, I will definitely do that. I don't care. But I just thought I'd get him a baby carrier for it's just like the simplicity of it and the easiness of it for him especially if he's watching Mia by himself and needs to put her like strap her in this is just a quick put her in doesn't have to like mess with all like the wraps and the slings but I think it's so sweet that he's like I will wear the wild bird sling or the solly wrap if you want me to but we just got this for convenience and this one you can wear it so many different ways the next thing we got is kind of like an organizational decor item for the nursery and you guys are gonna be like oh my goodness and it's this little guy right here it is this basket yama i don't know if you guys will be able to tell but he is currently filled with uh diapers because michael's aunt got this for us and she filled it with diapers but what i'm planning to do with this guy in her nursery is probably fill him with either blankets or stuffed animals i haven't decided yet but this little guy is from target it's by the opal house brand and it's super affordable so if you guys want like a basket like this for your nursery or doing yama themes definitely check this out because it is so dang cute next thing sticking with the yama since i see it right here technically it's a baby clothing item but i'm gonna include it right now it is this little hooded yama towel and it's pink and this is in the infant size and we got this at target i believe and I just think these are so stinking cute. I love when babies are in hooded towels. They just look so precious. And I mean, come on, how cute is this Yama one? So cute. We registered for some bottles. So the bottles that we registered for was the Tommy TP one that looks like this. And then we also got some from Philips Advent that look like this, which apparently are special edition, which I had no idea they had special edition bottles. But a tip really quick for you guys, um, if you guys order or register through Babyless like we did, which I highly, highly recommend, which another like plug over here, I did post my registry and guide blog post a couple weeks ago and you guys seem to love it so much. And there I break down everything that I registered for as well as my guide to registering, like some tips and tricks. And in there I say that one of the tips is for bottles. So instead of buying although these are like packs they only come i think three and three instead of buying like a bunch of packs like this let's say you want to try out all the bottles but you buy them in packs like this it's kind of a waste of money because you don't know what your baby is going to like so babyless offers a really really great bottle box that comes with five different bottles i believe they have the tommy tp the dr brand and just like other brands so it's one single bottle so you can try out one and see which one your baby likes which is amazing Amazing. I'm go I'm gonna go ahead and get that I registered for it but we didn't end up getting it so I'm gonna get it on my own because I want to see what baby girl likes in case breastfeeding doesn't go too too well just a quick tip like that or if you don't do it through a baby list you can just go ahead and buy a single pack or like a two pack of the bottles for you to see which one your baby will like Another tip that I shared in that blog post, I'm just plugging away, but this is a, like a good tip that you guys actually gave me, is that register for like full size bottles or just bigger bottles and then register for just like these nipples, like the slow flow nipples, because that way your baby can grow with these bottles instead of just having a bunch of little ones and then eventually getting these. You can just go ahead and get these right off the bat and then get these as an accessory and you're good to go. We also got some books. So we got this little book right here. We also got this little cloth book, which I think will be so fun for her to just like have to touch and just feel. And then this cute little fabric doll. Another quick little toy that we got was this stick and see spin wheel that you can just put on the bath or on their high chair like the baby has right here. Moving on to the bigger items that we got, I will just be talking about them because I literally just tried to move them over here to show you guys and it just did not go well. So we're just going to go ahead and talk about them. So we got a pack and play and the one that we got was is by Graco and I'm looking over there because it's right there and it is the reversible napper and changer. It's the Coralito one. I will link everything down below that I can for you guys so you guys can go ahead and easily shop it or link it to your own registry. And I got a pack and play because it was really recommended by people especially if you live in a two-story home 
home. That way when you're downstairs and baby needs to get changed or nap or something and you don't want to keep going up and down the stairs, a uh, pack and play is perfect, especially this one since it does have a bassinet and then all, that also converts into a changer. So that's awesome. And again, it grows with your baby. The next item that we got was a bouncer and this bouncer is so cute because it's safari theme. I really wanted to find one that was a Yama theme, but unfortunately they don't have that. But the next best thing was this one and it's the main focus is a giraffe, which is my favorite animal. So I was like, baby Mia, if you can't have your Yama, you are gonna have mama's favorite animal, which is a giraffe. Another item that we got was a walker and it is so cute. I keep I keep saying cute, but like baby items are just so stinking cute. I'm sorry guys. And the one that we got is a Minnie Mouse theme and it's super pink and it's not too big, which I like, but it still has all of like the fun stuff that walkers come with. We also got our crib and a crib mattress from my parents and the crib that I have is so, so like on a theme with our nursery you guys will definitely see a nursery tour soon and the nursery is kind of like boho organic feeling lots of like greenery and just like vintagey kind of feel so the crib that we have goes perfectly with that and what i love about it even more is that it is green guard certified which was very important for me for her furniture so i was so glad that it was green guard green card certified as well as on theme so i will definitely link that down below for you guys in case that is a top concern for you and you guys want to get a crib like that and then the mattress that we got is the newton baby one again went off your recommendations and that one has the highest reviews and i just love the comfort that i get knowing that baby will sleep really well in that crib because it's so breathable that they're not just going to roll over and then I'm going to have that panic. So especially being a first time mom, I really wanted something that made me at ease knowing that my baby was sleeping really, really well at night. So that's why I went with the Newton baby. So that is everything that we got for like baby items. So let's now move on to baby clothing. We got a set of little swaddles right here and I'm obsessed with these prints because she is coming in the summertime and I feel like these are just perfect for the summer because you got lemons, cherries, peaches, and then just a regular white one. So if you guys know me, you guys know I love denim and a jumpsuit and if you put those two together I am absolutely sold and baby girl has her own little denim jumpsuit now and I am obsessed I love all the detailing on it it is by Carter's it's you can get this at Target and this one is in the newborn newborn size which I am so excited because then again she's going to be here in the summertime so she will wear this and then I will wear my denim jumpsuit and we can be twinsies we got another little jumpsuit here and this one is pink pinstriped and it again has that embroidery detail which I'm all about embroidery so I was like yes give me all the embroidery for baby girl and this one again is by Carter's and this one is in the three month size I am having a total yellow moment I love anything yellow anything marigold Baby girl is going to have touches of marigold in her nursery. So when I saw this, I'm like, she is go definitely going to take a picture in her nursery in this cute little romper. And again, it has embroidery, it has marigold in it, it has pink. So cute. Again, oh no, this is by the Baby Cat and Jack line. And this one is in the three to six months. My favorite fruit is strawberries. So when I saw this, I kind of freaked out because she is my little strawberry. I mean, how cute is that little strawberry pockets? And this is by Carter's and this one is in the three months size. We got some bibs and these are just super simple pink and pink and white, pink and yellow ones from the Tommy TV brand. We got a sleeper and this sleeper is by Modern Baby and it is incredibly soft and it's just, so cute. The print actually reminds me of a Lily Pulitzer print, which I love Lily Pulitzer. 
and this is in the size zero to three months and I just cannot wait to put her in here. She's gonna look so cute. And even though it is like fleecy here in San Francisco, it does get pretty cold in the evenings. So she will definitely need something warm to sleep in. My friend Brianna got me the cutest little jumpsuit for her and I cannot wait to put her in this and match her again. And this one is just a really pretty light baby pink jumpsuit. This one is in the size 18 to 24 months, so she won't be in it for a long time. But I am looking forward to having her in this and she got this at a local boutique. A few other clothing items that we got was this sweet little pink dress. I love it because it has little tool right here. It's by Carter's and also comes with her little bloomers right here. And then, I, this is three months. And then I also got another one by Carter's, but this one is in a white and black little pink heart design. I love that it has like that little hand lettering, I'm all about hand lettering. And then it also comes with bloomers as well. Moving on to the last item that I have here, and this one is the most sentimental and most special gift that I received. And it is from my grandma, so it is her great grandma. And my grandma has, I believe, like 18 grandkids. And for all of her grandkids, she's always knitted them, you know, either a blanket or a little outfit. And now she is able to knit for her great grandkids. She has a total right now of two, and two are on their way right now. So she knitted Mia something, and I. I'm just speechless when I saw this and it just feels full circle because I have everything that my grandma knitted for me and I saved or my mom saved it and now Mia's going to be wearing my things and now my grandma is actually able to make her own like items for Mia. It's not like mine, it's her own. And I just think that's so special. So here it is. It's a, like a little outfit and it's this little hat that's pink and it's so cute. She has little booties to go with it. And then she has her little sweater that is just so delicate and has little buttons and I cannot wait to put her in this. So that is everything that I have for you guys. I hope you guys enjoyed. Like I said, I will be linking everything that I can down below for you guys. So it's super easy for you guys to shop and add to your own registry. I know that was like a lifesaver when I was watching these videos. I'm like, ooh, okay, I need that, I need that, I need that. And when I went to the description box, like it was all ready to go there. So that is what I'll have for you guys. Make sure to check that out. I will also have a link to my blog post about my registry and tips and tricks and any more like useful videos that I will put in there for you guys. So if you guys are pregnant right now, please let me know how far along you are. I love ch chatting with you guys. I am currently right now 33 weeks but when I put this up, I will be 34 weeks. And currently I'm feeling pretty good. I mean, I'm getting some leg cramps here and there, getting some nausea, but I can't complain because it's all for little Mia. So please let me know how far along you guys are. And if you like this video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up. And if you guys aren't a subscriber, don't forget to subscribe on your way out. That way you won't miss out on any new videos. A bunch of fun videos are gonna come your way. Nursery tour, day in the life pregnancy stuff just make sure to subscribe because I am trying to pump out as much videos as I can in the last few weeks and don't forget to follow me on Instagram because that is where I post on the daily about pregnancy about alpha inspiration what I'm loving it's a fun time over there and I love interacting with you guys there so go ahead and check it out it's always link down below so I guess I will end this video here because I am just rambling on and I'm sure this video is long enough so I hope you guys have a wonderful day and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye guys!